Let the picture sort itself out first. And Houston, we have a problem. May I call it neighbour? There was I having a pleasant nap. My alcoholic neighbour, absolutely paralytic drunk, and a friend came to see him. And the friend, he had a bad stroke some time ago, and he can hardly walk, his voice has gone, because he used to be a fire eater. And he's a physical wreck, but he's mentally, he's alright. And he came to my door, and I shouted, of course, sat on the sofa with my feet up, come in, three times, come in. And eventually this friend, Jez, that's Jeremy. He's unconscious. He needs an ambulance. Can you ring an ambulance? No, ring 999. Uh, uh, I says, hang on, hang on. Let me go and see. He needs an ambulance now. Panicking like I was. I went in. I said, Chez, what's up with you? And he's laid on the floor. Oh, I'm all right off. I don't need an ambulance. I said, Owen, he's not unconscious. He's unconscious. I've been through it all. I, I know. Get it. I said, Owen, he's not unconscious. Unconscious people don't fucking talk. And uh, I'd already pressed the button for central control. I said, I'm Mr. Hollyhead's neighbour, and a friend's come to see him, and he reckons he's unconscious. And I said, No. And Owen's standing inside of me, bawling, you know. <coughs> Get an ambulance here now. He's unconscious. I said, Owen, shut up. And central control said, uh, Mr. Dale, what's going on? I said, oh, Dear. And uh, I said, He don't need ambulances. Paralytic drunk, the same as he said every fucking day. Nothing new. So anyway, Owen went in there and I found Jeremy's mother, our family friend Mavis. She said, Look, Jeremy normally at this time of the day is in bed. And he gets up later on. Can you go in there and put Jez, Jeremy to bed? I said, I can't I can't lift him. He's that drunk he can't even stand and tell Owen to go. So eventually I went in there, I said, are, are you right there? I'm all right over, and Owen's still panicking, he needs an ambulance, can't you see, he's dying. I said, he's not fucking dying. And uh, I said, are you going to be all right there, Chad? I'll get you a quilt, but it's a hot day. No, I'm all right. I said, Owen, the message from Jeremy's mother, she wants you to go and stay away, don't come back. I went out on the balcony talking to my neighbour and Owen came out on the balcony. What kind of person are you? He says. <coughs> it's your neighbour. Get an ambulance here now. And I said, look, go and don't come back. Don't you fucking talk to me like that. I said, I'm only telling you what Jeremy's mother said. And of course, Owen is that bad on his feet. You know, he, I mean, he couldn't come up to me and try to hit me with his walking stick. It would take him five minutes. So I'm only telling you what Jeremy's mother says. She wants you to go. Don't come back. But I really don't need this. It's not my problem. And I've been in there again. Oh, he's gone. Yeah. But he, needs, he needs to be told. Stay away. I can't believe that Jeremy's got a full bottle of dark rum. His sister brings it him every day. According to his sister and his mother, he can't stop drinking or it'll kill him. What a load of bollocks. The alcohol will kill him. And I don't want to know. It's not my problem. I've got my own problems. But nothing I can't live with. We've all got problems. The mayor's got problems. Andrew's got problems. We all have. I'm getting involved in my alcoholic neighbour's problems. And Jess is absolutely paralytic. Yeah. But he had started on the with a bottle of dark room. His liver must be rotten. How long it's going to last? Well, but he's been drinking like it for a long, long time. He must have a liver, a liver made out of leather. <laughs> Say it properly. His liver must be made, must be made out of leather. So I, I really don't want to know. I don't want to get involved. Go away, Owen. Don't come back. And he said, "Don't you fucking talk to me like that." <sighs> write a book about this place. We see all life here. Oh yeah. Social evening tonight. So, but a lovely day. Hmm. Alright.
five minutes, that's long enough. Right, I'm off. Cheers. I am. <laughs>